Hello learners, here we are given that uh, Z1 is minus 1 and Z2 is I. We need to find out argument of Z1 by Z2. Okay, first before I find out the argument of Z1 by Z2, I need to know the argument of Z1. Next, I need to know the argument of Z2. Okay, Chalo. so stay with me. I'm going to make it easy for you. This is the first complex number. Z1 is minus 1. Okay. Now I want to write, now I want to like write it as a point. So I need... I am going to write it like this uh, Z, uh, Z1 as minus 1 plus i into 0. It is totally okay. So, this is nothing but minus 1 comma 0 because a complex number can be represented on the two dimensional plane. Okay. Fine. On a, on a Cartesian plane, we can represent this. So, that is what we get minus 1 comma 0. Now, you might think wow, what will we get by doing this? We can find out argument by doing this. Why? This is my positive x, uh, positive y. Okay. Minus 1 comma 0 is somewhere here. Minus 1 comma 0 is somewhere here. Now connect origin and this point. Connect origin and this point. This line makes this uh, with positive x axis. Okay. With positive x axis, this makes this much angle. This line with positive x axis, it makes uh, the this part with positive x axis, it makes this much angle. It is nothing but 180 degrees. Okay. That's what my argument is going to be. Likewise, next point is z2 is i so i can be written as i into 1 and i just put a 0 because real part is not there i just wrote 0 0 plus i into 1 so this point is nothing but 0 comma 1 i hope things are clear now this 0 comma 1 if i were to plot it 0 comma 1 if i were to plot it um, okay um, if i were to plot it so this would be 0 comma 1 now connect origin and this. So see this would make something like 90 degrees. So the argument is pi by 2. So the argument is pi by 2. Since it lies on positive y axis, argument of z2 is nothing but pi by 2. Okay. Now they are asking us to find out argument of z1 by z2. Argument of z1 by z2 in this case is nothing but argument of z1 minus argument of z2. Okay. Fine. Shallow. So, the substitute argument of z1 is pi, argument of z2 is pi by 2 is pi minus pi by 2. Answer is pi by 2. That's it. Thank you very much for staying with me up till now. Uh, in case you like this video, please hit the like button. And uh, do check out my channel for other, other videos uh, related to intermediate mathematics. Thank you.